Uh, the sport of ice hockey is booming on campus over at Arizona State University. The men's hockey team picking up some big wins this season. As for the Sun Devil women, they are headed for the playoffs. The ladies team, though, considered a club sport, so they need some help to chase down their championship dream. Here's Mark McClune. To be great, you have to pay the price. After some huge wins this season, the ASU women's hockey team has secured a spot in the Western Women's Collegiate Hockey League playoffs later this month in Fremont, Nebraska. Wow, it's been so special. Uh, as a first year team last year, all we hoped is that we would make a name for ourselves. We're, we're definitely um, the underdogs and I think that um, we've earned this spot and we're ready to, to go to Nebraska and show that AZ girls can, can play some hockey. The Sun Devil women aren't on scholarship and it's going to cost an additional $15,000 to go to the playoffs. So they've set up a GoFundMe and are already halfway to their $5,000 goal. It means so much to us. That is so cool that people would donate for us. I mean, this is everything we've worked for and all we can ask is to grow it for the girls. We appreciate everyone who's helping, everyone who's, who's contributing to our team and, and funding for us. Casey and Taylor never dreamed they would be playing for their hometown team. Both seniors, they started playing together as kids here in the Valley. Yes, we did on AZ Selects and then Lady Coyotes. And then that was when we were in um, high school. And then after we graduated, of course, we, we needed to go to the East Coast. I played in Colorado after I graduated. I actually did play on the East Coast and to come back and finish my career has been indescribable. Well, the Sun Devils have made it to the playoffs with just two lines and one goalie. And practices typically start at seven o'clock in the morning. You know, when the when the inaugural season started, it was pretty tough waking up. I mean, not for this one because she's an early bird every day. Most schools have the opportunity to just drive a couple hours to go play their opponents, but we have to fly or bus, bus 15 hours. And hopefully we can grow hockey on the West Coast so that the future generation gets that opportunity to just have those quick road trips, but I wouldn't change it for the world. The Sun Devil women close out the regular season with a trip to Miami of Ohio and Ohio State this weekend with a trip to Nationals, funds willing, Scheduled for February 22nd. I'm Mark McClune for Arizona's.